Hey everybody, welcome to part 8 of the Final Fantasy 7 Let's Play. Uh, shit, something's happening. She's getting real. Sounds like fireworks display. Yeah, damn right. Happy 4th of July, everybody. Um, it's... it's, it's West July. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit, it's Actually, a war zone. are there months? Are there months in Seven's world? I'd imagine so. Yeah. Is like, there a January through December? Yeah, that, they, I think they actually did something. They Isn't that in guest videos? <sighs> I I can't remember pro Professor's videos, but uh, I'm trying to think back to the, the Final Fantasy Seven manual. Oh. Oh, fuck. Wedge dead. He's, he's big. I'm surprised he didn't make a street pizza. Yo, I can't believe Wedge is fucking dead. Not yet. He's, just, huh? he's dying. <laughs> <laughs> we, have, we have cure materia. No, man, you know how it works. Yeah. Just gotta shove it up the ass. That's how it works. Good news, Wedge. It's a suppository. <laughs> now spread your wedge. <laughs> <laughs> we have a phoenix down, but... um, It's a, it's pretty much like a feather you use to tickle people to wake up. Go on, Basically. get up. Take a tick. Gucci, gucci. <laughs> you gotta take it down in one gulp. I'm sorry, Wedge. All right, so here's what's happening. Shinra is getting ready to destroy the support pillar of Sector 7. Oh Without boy. that pillar, that whole plate above the sector goes crashing down to the place, and that can kill everybody on, underneath. We gotta stop them. I hope we can stop them. We already lost Wedge, though. Wedge is dead. Do you think, are we gonna lose other people? I think we might lose everybody. I had you some fun with that money, huh? This is the end of the game. Final boss is the pillar. <laughs> Just grows arms and legs and Six angel wings, just to be safe. It's Final Fantasy. You're, conf you're confusing Final Fantasy Seven with Resident Evil Four. Did Resident Evil Four have six angel wings? No. Mm, he had six legs. It's like a spider and a lot of eyes. I mean, Krauser had a wing. Did Krauser ever? Krauser. It was technically an arm wing, but it was yeah, still like a, a wing. Like, a, like an arm flail. It, it was still a wing. No, not really. No, there was feathers. Was there feathers? Yeah. I don't recall that at all. Did there were feathers. Oh no, Biggs. Okay, I'm gonna. All right, so here's one thing. I I think I want to assume Biggs just slumped over the railing, and he didn't just fall onto the railing like that. <laughs> Otherwise, he he, <laughs> he should drunk. He should, he should be, be dead. He, he should over. be sliced in half. Anyway, these are the only encounters we fight on the way up to the the, the like pillar. troops. Yeah, basically these guys. So uh, uh, these they, guys look like tools. Uh, <laughs> 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 so basically, they they start in the air, and when you do enough damage to them, their propellers stop working and they fall. Does down. Does Bolt also <laughs> knock them out of the air? I don't know if Bolt knocks them out of the air, but I do know it does more damage overall because they are technically mechanical. <laughs> Just breaks. It just stops going. Ah, oh, damn it. <laughs> You know, uh, again, I didn't e I didn't see the propeller on, like, some sort of uh, rotary uh, early on. I thought the guys were just spinning them really rapidly with their hands. <laughs> like, like, and then falling down, like, fuck, I'm tired. <laughs> like, my hand is cramped. I can't I can't keep up with this. Like, is it, they're not even actual, like, blade, propeller blades. There's just yo-yos. Yeah, fidget spinners, I basically. love that they all... <laughs> I like that this was what the Shinra head of weapons development thought was a good idea. <laughs> you're going to hold this, and then you're going to fly everywhere on one arm. All right. As can opposed to a plane. A, can you just give it's me like, a jetpack? Right. All right, listen. Jetpacks? That's unfeasible. All right, listen. Listen. Propeller hands. <laughs> Hojo applauded. <laughs> the only one in the office that did. <laughs> Everybody else is just okay. too nervous. Now. Dog fucking. All right. Oh, my son Doofus liked it. <laughs> <laughs> I would have just said, is that so? Oh, These yes. are all the questions you give here are basically affection points for Barrett. Well, yeah. yeah. Uh, somehow, I don't know. <laughs> because I guess Barrett overhears you. Yeah, unfortunately, we lost pretty much everybody in Avalanche. Wedge, all three of them. Biggs, Je yeah, I know, all three of them. Damn. I like Jess. Jesse's cool. But I like Wedge more. They brought back Jesse's design in 14 as well. She's a bitch in that one. But <laughs> she's my bitch. All right, you gotta press triangle. What the fuck is a triangle? <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, pyramid. I saw slips. Wait, uh, didn't Tifa have the chance to get the um metal glove? Metal glove? Where? In the Walmart. The wall? What metal glove? <laughs> yeah, what? she gets a second weapon there. I Walmart. No. <laughs> 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 Is that Reno? Yeah, that's Reno. Making sure the bomb goes off. 
No, don't push it. Oh, he pushed it. That's all, folks. All Mission right. accomplished. Buddy, 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 everyone's dying. <laughs> <laughs> this is the most professional arena we'll ever be. Yeah. Because after this, it becomes a fucking I like this character. one. Yeah, I know. He's really cold in this one. But then they realize, hey, we kind of made Axel look like him, so let's do it in reverse. <laughs> There's potential with this. Way before the pyramid actually goes up. Otherwise, you're just going to hit your own ally. Yeah. Try and break it if you can. Oh, well, shit. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, this is my taser. <laughs> taser. Yeah, he, he just comes out <laughs> cattle prod. <Yeah. laughs> oh, don't poke me with that cattle prod. <laughs> anyway, uh, our main means of attack just could be throwing grenades at him. Just fuck him. <laughs> just, just, just throw active grenades. He could take him. it. Every once in a while, he'll do pyramid shot, which will encapsulate someone in a pyramid, and that person can't do any action until the pyramid's broken. If all three party members are trapped in the pyramid, that is game over. Fuck. Don't let it happen. Just fucking prioritize the pyramid as soon as it shows up. Which is a little weird because later down the road, this another battle is going to have a similar. <laughs> I got mechanic. to go. <laughs> and I, I my my mind gets the wires crossed all the time because in the second fight that has a mechanic like that, you have to actively select the jail separately. In this fight, the pyramid is the same target as the player character. Oh. And I keep thinking that I'm going to hit the person and not the pyramid. As much as no sense that much it makes at all. I don't, I don't understand how that works. Oh, we should look at the time. He's not wearing a watch. <laughs> <laughs> he drew the watch it's on his three wrist. Three hairs to one. <laughs> See ya. You got an ether out of it. All right, another 700. And Diva just goes for a spin. Where do you land? On top of a helicopter. <laughs> right through the helicopter blades. Yeah. So Ada, Ada can do it. Reno can do it. <laughs> it's not a normal time bomb. It's an advanced time <laughs> bomb. <laughs> uh, right. Sang. Oh, blow the second some stupid jerk touches it. It's going to blow now. <laughs> Thankfully <laughs> for you, I'm a smart jerk. <laughs> I may be a jerk. And? <laughs> I wouldn't try that. You might hit somebody. I'll, uh, uh, you're just terrible aim altogether. <laughs> oops! What happened? No, oops. Oh. <laughs> Should I shot Aerith in the face. <laughs> That's a tiny our helicopter, Our orders were to though. find and catch the remaining ancient. We sure took our sweet ass time, though. <laughs> I think we were going for a record. We knew she lived in that house since, uh, since, since childhood, but he's like, well, you know what? We'll do it now. We were just waiting. Biding Which is kind of time. weird, considering that, you know, the Turks are called in for the black market wet work. So... What stopped them earlier? I don't know. <laughs> Bad press. I know, I know we, touched, we touched about it earlier. It's like, but you always had the intention of studying the last ancient for the sake of finding the elusive promised land of an area f fertile with Mako or Mako. Then uh, why would the hell would you ever let her out of your sights at all? <laughs> you know, it's kind of weird. Thank goodness! Oh, thank goodness! I could do this with one arm. <laughs> I like latch placement here. Do yeah. not fall. <laughs> I know. It's like it's <laughs> Don't touch my butt. How was your night? Uh, Barrett's head was on my ass again. <laughs> I always find I always find it weird with, with like the um. Oh fuck. Yeah. Yeah. Entire, that's an entire plate. That's entire like a whole plate. city. Yeah. Plus, I didn't realize the scene at first. That is the scene. That's a plate above. Rather, I yeah. didn't realize what that was at first when I saw that in the uh, room. Well, they're dead. They're no more sector seven. No more sector seven. Both Looks above. like they're all going to a seventh heaven. And the, the folks above the plate are dead, too, right? Yeah. It's just a complete collapse. Yeah. While he plays stopper music. 20 years ago, you would have told me this is cartoonish evil. Post-2016? Well, oh, no, it's still cartoonish. It, no. That, no, but you can you can still label the real life as good, our cartoonish as well because of how ridiculous it is. <laughs> the, the camera angle has showed the mayor in, You fool! It's chaos! <laughs> <laughs> Like I always, I always find it weird how you see the pre-rendered backgrounds, but then like there's also the 3D models coming in with during the cutscene as well. Yeah. Well, no, because it's technically all 3D. Yeah. You know, it's only pre-rendered when they have to stop making it 3D for a moment, but they can change it back to a 3D environment on a whim. Yeah. Because it is originally a 3D environment. You know, that's the entire point of pre-rendered. Well, shit. <laughs> is that my muffler? Does kind of look like a giant, uh. Yeah, it does look like a really big muffler. 
My muffler! President Shinra is gonna pay. Fuck. He also said damn it all to hell, I believe, in the original PS. You maniacs! <laughs> damn you! <laughs> Damns you all to hell! Just the bars on the floor burning. Where am I gonna drink now? That was my favorite pinball machine. Right? <laughs> my hideout's gone. This really sucks, though. But worst of all, my bar is gone. How am I gonna pay for Marlene's schooling now? <laughs> what am I gonna do about a Marlene? I'm out one Marlene. Shit. I'm out one Marlene. <laughs> I only had one of those. <laughs> Boy, I hope Don's. I hope. Good thing Don's dead. He'd be pissed at me for that one. Who's dying? This says Tifa. <laughs> Anyway, all three uh, of them were in a pillar. No shit, Cloud. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah even Bear is like, yeah, we know this. Uh, Bear's a little. Bear's very distraught though because he thinks he lost his daughter, but uh, but no. Marley, if you've watched Marley Advent Children, <laughs> <laughs> well, yeah, if you want to just use that. <laughs> but, no, but it's uh, if you recall, before uh, Aerith and Sen took off in the helicopter, Aerith did clarify that she is safe, and Tifa thinks that she's talking about Marlene. She is. He's, he's citing the same. He's citing what is known as the madman's excuse. He's right in what he's saying, but it's really just a front for his own anger. Well, yeah, obviously. My my feelings. Your feelings of what? What about you? What well, do you? I, know, I don't. Really, <laughs> <laughs> you really like that bar, but you know, well, I lost a daughter. I lost the bar to win the war. <laughs> <laughs> well, I just like oh, oops. <laughs> Dropping sectors to own the libs. <laughs> <laughs> and there goes like what the only playground in the world. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I don't think we uh, do. We ever see another playground in this world? I can't think of any. I don't think there is because every other town that we go to, calm is calm. The Chocobo Ranch, the Chocobo Ranch. There's June and June is the only place I have playgrounds. Uh, Coast of the Soul is an adult playground. It's a beach. Yeah. Gold Saucer, I guess, would count. Yeah. Like, okay, Gold Saucer, sure. Nibble, Nibbleheim don't have any Nibble rocket Ham, down there. No, Nibbleheim doesn't have any. Nibbleheiny. Rocket Town. No. Wu Tai. Mm, maybe for Yuffie. <laughs> it's a big ass hand. That it is. Too is that a Gundam? Anywhere. I don't know what the hand's supposed to be. Is that a Gundam? The Proud Cloud Hand. Baby. Oh, I would love that. We just constructed this giant mech from scraps we found in Sector 5. Yeah, if it works. How about this guy or sick? He any better? No, we're not going to check on him until our second visit. No, oh, okay. Technically our second visit now. I mean, our third visit. Maybe. Please don't lie to me, John. No, <laughs> I'm not. Why would I ever lie to you? <laughs> that actually is rather hitting home. Like yeah, this place sucks, and I can't do anything about it. That's always like that always that's always sucks to hear. Think, yeah, because we we're talking about this uh, earlier in the parts where these folks they can't really go anywhere. They can't afford to move up to the above the plate. They can't even afford. They can't. Even, I don't even think they can get out. Yeah. Do they all have key cards to sector eight? Well, no. The, I think they can leave at any time. No, I mean like key cards to sector eight. Like, can they go out that door? I want to. You see, the, I always took that door is that you needed a key card to get in, not leave. Mm, maybe that's the way I took it. I'm not saying it's what it is. It's the way I took it. But I the problem—it'd be weird if you had a key card that only worked one way, and then yeah. you're shit out of luck if it jams <laughs> the other way. <laughs> but it, you know, it, it's it's kind of a, a situation they have to think about because you know this place sucks. And the fucking sector just dropped next yeah. to us. Is like, God, do we stay here? I mean, do we try and move How do I feel else? that my life is in the hands of a petty capitalist <laughs> that is happy to crush my skull on a second thought to own the libs? Ser like, like, literally in this case. That's what Oops wanted. Wait, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Oops is an agent. <laughs> the sole survivor. We call her Oops. Oh, God, that's oh, going to make God. this too fucking funny. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, we get a little backstory here because uh, we have to tell Myra that. Uh, One thing I really can't like, wait for in future re-releases: the skip scene feature. 
I love watching. I like Final Fantasy VII story, but sometimes when I'm just enough to play, I gotta go. <laughs> hey, is that big as wedge over there? Yeah, it's big as wedge over there. Yeah. Or just for his model. Because it's just a re- no, no, no. That's I, Jesse. I always took it as big uh, Jesse. I'm sorry. Jesse, yeah. Yeah, that's Jesse. I there. said wedge. Yeah. Holy shit! Yeah. I, holy shit! Gannon yeah. Ben Maya. That's a lot of weight. Anyway, so Amira had a husband. I, he was involved in the Wu Tai War. Yeah. Hopefully, we didn't see him die when we were playing Crisis Core. Uh, yeah, I know because we were in the middle of that. <laughs> I was like, what if Zach is the reason why he died? Holy shit! Never thought about that. That's kind of dark. <laughs> yeah, p- potentially. Yeah. Yeah. Amara, Amara had a husband, and she he was sent to Wu Tai to, to fight a war, and he, she's every day coming to the train station. To, Hopefully he comes back. He doesn't. Never does. Yeah, nope. he got lost at Wu Tai. Never yeah. came back. No, he lost all his materia. Oh, his damn! Materia Yuffie. is the only way you can fund a boat back to the continent. But then one day, while she was checking a train, uh, there's this person just dying on the stairway, and the the, the guard has gives no fucks about this at all. That's because he. <laughs> it's, that's it's, because he's dedicated <laughs> not to move from a spot. It's kind. It's kind of it's kinda like bus drivers. When shit goes on in the bus, they don't pay attention. They I just think keep if on there driving. was a fucking corpse inside the bus, or at least right outside the door, you do something. Now, now the people would just yell "back door, dickhead," and throw the corpse out. <laughs> oh, I thought I heard something. Yeah, that's usually the. Uh, that's practically like the uh, septa slogan: "back door, dickhead." <laughs> 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 Sounds like a really petty boxing nickname. <laughs> the back door dickhead. Back door <laughs> dickhead. <laughs> so basically, this child told me how she got away from the lab and her mom returned to the planet. What? <laughs> oh, kids say the darndest things. <laughs> what did she say next? My fa- my husband died. Oh, fuck. <laughs> She's absolutely right. That's exactly what she says. This is one day that uh, Aerith comes down to visit Elmira and says that someone you, someone who's really close to you has just passed away. Hey, do you have a husband? Yeah. Welp. <laughs> have you ever heard of Tinder? <laughs> <laughs> Look at it this way. He'll be your new light bulb. His spirit was coming to see you, but he's already returned to the planet. He got lost even in death. <laughs> Shit! No, he became Mako Energy. Oh damn! He's part of the life force now. No, he's now no now he now he's our light fixture. Yeah, stuck in the <laughs> pottery. <laughs> yeah, see, this is what I'm talking about earlier. It's Oops, like, you're a very special child. So, uh, <laughs> like, ooh, don't want any of that. Um, no, this is what we were talking about earlier, though. The Turks knew Arif lives here since childhood. But then they just could They just didn't take her. But it's like if you always had the intention of studying her because she's the last of her kind, an ancient or etc. As I'll say later. I mean, why wait so long? Like, could it be that they didn't know that her power is fully developed? Or well, no, but they know she's special though already though. I like think, if they I, knew I if they knew she was special reason. from the get go, they they would yeah. have to take and her. Considering by considering the one behind you're the right. scenes in research development, Hojo. <laughs> oh yeah, you're right. You know, it, I always found it odd that they wait till they wait so long to get to Aerith. Like, it, and, but to be fair to the the story, she they, it, they do imply, if not outright say that Aerith, you know, tries to you know, outrun them at all times. Yeah, but it's also so like at that point, why not just raise the house? Yeah, that that would be something the Turks would do. Yeah. So uh, I'm hoping that's something the remake clarifies or at least rewrites because that always did bother me in this story. Also, the creaky floorboard. Just go on. W- WD-40. <laughs> Just <laughs> put it on the floor. <laughs> WD-40, you know how expensive that materia is? Uh, I wasn't aware WD-40 was a materia. Everything in this world is a fucking materia. You just gotta clap your hands and boom. <laughs> put a giant fucking can inside the Buster's sword slot. It's like, is that a can of WD-40? I heard it was a materia. No material, idiot. Remember, you <laughs> Usage promotes wear, tear, and rust. <laughs> <laughs> Your whiskers hurt. Well, at least Marlene's safe. Thankfully. Do not hug me with your gun hand. <laughs> Making me nervous, man. It's okay, I'm out of ammo. <laughs> you just It just spins the entire time. I kind of, you know, can you imagine her, him, him holding the chainsaw in his hand like, oh, uh, you just slept at the fucking woman's house. <laughs> yeah, why not? I'm pooped. 
Hey, a whole sector came down. <laughs> Turks took a sweet I'm ass time. I'm fucking tired, Turks man. Turks took a sweet ass time, so can I. <laughs> <laughs> like, a whole sector came down. I'm tired of shit. I just want to sleep for a bit, man. And somebody else's bed. <laughs> Tifa, were you here for, like, a whole day? Yeah. How'd you not get tired, Materia? You know, there are only two beds in the, in the second floor. So when Cloud was here the first time, just take a snooze on the left. Eric takes a snooze on the right. It's like, where the fuck am I going to sleep? <laughs> <laughs> where does Amara sleep? Yeah, where does Amara sleep? Well, I imagine, oh, normally I imagine there's two beds, two people upstairs. But right, now it's right, like right. six people. So exactly. The attic. Maybe. By the way, really from this, angle, from this angle from this angle here, it looks like Omira doesn't have any feet, so she looks like a Lego block person. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> now we're going to raid Shinra headquarters. Yeah, Gotta fuck get Shinra. Aerith back. What'd you say? Fuck Shinra. Oh, there you go. Oh, okay. I, I'm sorry, Mr. Sergeant. You said fuck Aerith. I was like, who's Aerith? Yeah. <laughs> oops, I meant oops. <laughs> Aerith, oops. <laughs> We gotta go to Walmart though. We gotta get some stuff. Like, Walmart, and- like cat food. <laughs> <laughs> we gotta get something at the Walmart. We'll see you guys. What we're gonna get next time? Later. <laughs>